Hello and welcome to World of Tanks. Uh, I just thought I'd do... I had loads of footage on this my hard drive, but I decided to get rid of it all because I wasn't using it. It was just clogging up space. But I think I might just have a few goes on this and upload a few videos of me playing. So I'm going to play the Centurion Tank. I've done a lot of grinding since I've uploaded the last video. Since last time I had, what was it? The Crusader. If that. So that was quite a few tears down. Anyway, I'll just play a few games because why the hell not? Centurion's a lovely tank if we can play it. And sometimes it's terrible. There's artillery, which there is. It dies in one, which is strange because historically it it shrugged off all artillery and they did no damage to it. But hey, you know, there's wargaming.net for you. British tanks, they don't care. Any hooser. Let's see what's going on. So it's probably just going to be a go for the hill, I suppose. If it's the map, I, it's definitely the map I think it is. Lots of uh, anti-tanks there, and lots of heavies, as usual. On their side, but not on ours. Take the hill, no shit, Sherlock. Let's go then. Time to roll out. Oh, that's quite loud. There we go. A little bit better. So, job is support the heavies. As always. And they're just going across open. Why are they doing that? I suppose the scout, but why is the Taika 2 going there? Let's get a shot off on him. Oh, what? That was a bit... Uh, did I shoot him again? No. No damage. Hit him. Probably just pinged. Uh, let's have a look here. Yeah. So let's try and get, hold down up here. Oh, can I hit him? I can. Fantastic. Come on, can I do some damage? Got the AT7 there, so he's going to give him a pound. Oh no, he's moving. There we go. Oh, artillery can see me. Fuck, 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 fuck. Think about six cents in this tank. As soon as the enemy sees you, you move the fuck out of the way. If they got artillery, anyway. Penetration. Penetration, no damage, of course. And they ricocheted off my turret. Which is always good. Oh, they actually got through that time. There we go, got a kill. Lovely. Got a KV-5 coming on the flank. I'm not hold down, I'm going to have to move. They're just ricocheting off my turret. Some, some of them actually got through. That's not good. Damn, I missed. And I heard artillery shots. But I can get this guy. I can hurt him. We need to stop him from attacking our forces. One more shot and he's, he's dead. He's out of the game. We've got a Jag Panzer over here. Can I get a shot on him? No, it's all good. There's a Super Pershing over here. Let's teach him the meaning of British steel. Where are you? Ah, oh, ah. Oh. Rio on the jag! Come back here. Oh, he's retreating. What a coward. Oh, come on. Pop over the hill. Oh, come on. Pop over the hill. You know you want to so bad. Now nah, they're all retreating because we're advancing too fast over the hill. So, what's the plan? I suppose support the heavies a bit more, get some good shots off. Hope I, do, I hit them and actually do damage. Because that's the main problem in this tank with this current gun. Rush? Yes, I agree. Let's rush. We've only lost two tanks. They've lost a shit ton. They've lost six. And some of the heavies as well. They've only got three heavies left. Oh, yes. We've only lost a tank destroyer and a scout. Oh, yes. We get the super pushing again. Go, go. All. I'm not going to charge. The tank does not charge. 
Damn, didn't get shot on that. Died just before. Let's advance down the hill. I should really get vents on this because the reload speed is quite terrible. 6.9 and it's not the, even the powerful gun. Because I can't get the powerful gun on this one, it's on the next one. Damn, happened again. Come on, you guys go first, I'll follow. I don't think I actually hit that, I think I missed it. Which is a shame. I should get the minus 10 reload speed mod thing, modification vehicle thing, but hey. <clears throat> moment I've got the um, coated optics, because view range of this thing is important. Oh, they've even got a few tanks left. This is just mopping up now. Hope I get a few shots off before everyone kills them. I'm going to try and speed up and overtake some of these guys, because I know I'm faster than the Lau. Go, go, all oh, we know! Ah, fuck. I just want to get one more hit off. Some more damage. Because I haven't done much damage in this game. Be lucky I've got a thousand off. Damn, didn't get that. Got him. He's dead. Red team, please don't camp. Kill idiots. What else are they going to do? They're being hunted by a massive group of tanks. It's just a Tiger 2 left. Who managed to get a kill? Look at him. It was only against a tier 6 though, so it's not really much of a... Go. I might be able to get a second kill. Hopefully, we'll get certainly a bit more damage. Nice. Definitely got over a thousand damage in this game so far, I reckon. Oh no! I could have got the kill on that, but it ricocheted. The fucking ah, oh, the paper armor tank ricocheted my shot. I'm dis that always happens to me. It's always the last shot to miss. Anyway, that's times two bonus. Not in two thousand. Let's have a look. So that's 1,700 damage. Could have done better. But I did I did quite good. I got the s out of everyone. I got the third most damage out of everyone. So not too bad. Detail reports. We made some money. I have 1,000 potential damage. But I think I only actually lost 200. So that's not bad. That's from all the pinging on the turret. And oh, some penetrations there as well. Oh, it's all good. So that's a lovely game I had in that. If I didn't kill that guy, I would have got confederate, but hey, I'd like, rather have the kill, to be honest. Oh, let's have another game in this. I'm enjoying it so far. My favourite tech so far. I can't wait till the next one. It's actually got good front armour, not just on the turret. Its best gun is apparently like a laser gun. Not literally. That would be silly. Very silly indeed. Oh, city maps. This tank is absolutely shite. Shit to do as a shit stick with stick on a shit and shit on a stick. So I'm gonna try and find somewhere I can hold down. Usually far top left I go, but I always die when I go there. I get overrun. That's where the artillery usually goes, so I have to kind of protect them. No, fuck off. What's he doing? F9. F oh, that's suicide. <clears throat> do I look like a tier raid tank destroyer? Ah, uh, people are moaning each other in the comments. Why is he getting so angry about someone in just saying ghost just activating someone on the map? Ah, oh, people on this game sometimes. People on the internet. They need to take a chill pill or two. Lost. Already! What? The game hasn't even started and he said lost because some people were arguing. I think was it on League of Legends? There's this thing that says, uh... Because we have Lau and T34. There's this uh, thing that says, I can't remember, if people who um, have a go at their teammates are 13% more likely to lose. Who are fucking idiots. Oh, people are moaning at each other like little bitches. 
They belong in a lol tractor. Don't diss the lol tractor. Not in a tier 8 tank. That's probably true when you get people who don't know what they're doing in high tier premium tanks. It's never fun. Unless they're your enemy, in which case it's okay. Unless you're lower tier than them, in which case it's not. Okay, so are we pushing on this flank, thanks? If we are, I'm not going to stay in the hell down. I'm going to have to advance with them. Now they're going behind the building. It's the IS. We've got the Lao there, just charging off ahead. And a T-34 over there. And a Tiger. Oh, it's the Tiger's there, actually. t 34s all the other side. Okay. Enemy sighted. I can take... There we go. Your hit. Ah, oh, damn. I wish I saw him earlier. I was too busy chatting to myself like a madman. What are you going to do, madman? Damn, I missed him. Damn, he's in cover. Come on, try and flank me, you bitch. I dare you. Did he just destroy some of the artillery? He did, he destroyed some of the fucking artillery. Fuck's sake. Oh, fuck's sake, nearly. Both of our two, yeah, we're dead. Oh, fuck, he bounced off and hit him with the fucking tracks. How did I bounce off? Oh, fuck, we're so lost this. I'm about to be flanked, I didn't tell. I can feel it in my fingers. Idiot team. You're the one who charged ahead didn't get any cover, you fucking mong. You're a premium tank, not elite. Oh, fuck. I mean, you're going to be flanked soon anyway, so... Whoa! Fuck's sake. We nailed it back. No! One of our tracks. Yes! Find another target. We've got a kill. I'm happy with that. Even if that comment wasn't there, I would have done so much better, but hey, I knew I could get a kill. Hold them off for a bit. I'm glad about that, got a kill, so, uh, try and get a killer match. I'm so far 25 points behind. I was three close to having the same amount of kills as matches, but then it all went fucked up, and now I'm like 16 behind. Now it's just one IS by himself, he's gonna die very soon. Poor IS. <laughs> Show your front armour, mate. Yeah, that's it, not your side. He's going to rape you as soon as you turn that corner. There we go. You could have got him before, but he was not ready. But hey. That was a bad game. 537 experience, though, for a loss. Not too bad. Did some damage. How much did I do over? I did 1,600 damage. Not too bad. Nowhere near as good as the Jag Tig, who actually um, seems to be our best player. But uh, but for instance, the Lao did a lot, but he wasn't very good because he just stayed in the open like a mong. 
I lost money on that. I'm okay with though, because I did a bit of damage. I got a bit of experience, considering it was a loss. It's not too bad. And it's a city map which this tank isn't too great at. And I could have done a lot more damage if I actually focused on those people tanks with, that was fighting the Lao at the time. But I didn't. I was a bit of an idiot there. Could have done a lot more. Oh, this map, sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. No artillery! Fuck yes! That's the way to go! Ah. Oh. Oh, yes, no artillery is the way I like it. Dum, 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 dum. Ah, so it's ready to kill someone? Okay. We'll head up to this left bit, we'll hull down a little bit and try and snipe the bastards while the heavies engage, since half our team is pretty much heavies. One thing that does annoy me about this game, everyone is fucking heavies. Every, other tanks have their place. And I'm not a fan of the idea of the British tank destroyers, from what I've seen of them, they, uh, they're quite good, they've got really strong frontal armour and really good guns, so I might try them out at some point. That I'm going to bounce over here and keep people off from fucking over people trying to enter the town. It's at least, at the most, I'll just discourage them. Try not to destroy the tree. And no one's coming here. There's a few heavies still back at base. Oh, it's the Black Prince. They're slow as fuck, so I'll forgive them. There we go, damage done. Let's get down while I'm reloading, get back into a hold down position over here and hopefully just be a fucking nuisance. That's the plan. Enemy is hit. It's a Hellcat there. They always do a ton, ton of damage to me. Oh, what are they doing there, sitting there? Yeah. Oh no! No, loader, I'm healing you. I'll oh, flank up, fuck, I'm being flanked. There's a shit ton of heavies there, still keep them occupied. But I still don't want to risk it. Two tank. We've got a medium right here. Nah. Penetration. They blew off our track. We're stuck. Who did that? T forty three. Enemy is hit. Someone just keeps shooting me. They're not doing much damage, but these track it up. Let's go. They're hit. Enemy is hit. Okay, more of a hold down. That was my fault. Oh no, and I'm being hit from over here. Shit, shit, this is a bad position, bad position. No, you gotta be fucking joking! He hits me, but I don't. I'm gonna die. I might be able to kill him though. No, I didn't get to kill him. What the fuck? Okay, this game's not going good for me. I didn't expect them to get such strong on this flank, and then they're over there, and somehow I don't know. I did bad, and I should feel bad. 
Oh, someone can see me as well. It's even worse. So I'm just going to hide here until I can get a good shot off. Can't spot over there. I can't go over here because I will die instantly. I still have a gun though that works. Just fine. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. Easy kill, because I am. There we go. Did some damage though. This is a this is bad loss anyway, we've been stomped. But at least I got some damage off. I If I wasn't flanked at the rear and I didn't panic. And there's someone shooting me from over there, that was fine, they were doing hardly any damage. I mean I was getting shot from the rear as well, because I thought they would push through because there were loads of heavies there, but they didn't. And uh, I could have supported them all. Maybe they would have pushed through if I did that. That's two losses in a row. That's never good. I very rarely get that in the Centurion. I, before this, I had a 57% win rate. And that's nearly 100 games. I think it's over 100 games now. The T poor T-34. Oh, 600. Is that ammo rack or something? Obviously, you just got a really derp gun. He's too slow, he's going to die so bad. You can shoot the tiger, it's got a good gun and no armour. Oh, this guy with 87 health thing wants to take him out. They killed our driver, we're covering his position, but not very well. Yeah, you're taking care of the tiger, now he's ranking. What are you doing? Ah, oh. I think this T-34 driver is not very good. He didn't even shoot anyone, he just kind of stayed there. Then again, I can't talk, I wasn't very good on that either. We got stomped quite badly. 400 experience. I did 1,003, I did the second most damage of anyone on my team, 1,300. Not as much damage, not as much as I actually have. So that's not good, I like to have do more damage than my tank has HP. If I didn't use that consumable, I would have lost only 900, but hey, who cares. Let's have a look at the service record over all 50... Ah, oh, still 57? It's not too bad. I've, I've got over a thousand um, damage per game on average. So I think that's alright. And I've got a few confederate steel walls and uh, snipers. As well as a single Spartan. Because, yeah, fuck yeah. That's how good the turret is on this tank. It's the only good part with armour. Everywhere else, pfft, paper. Ah, oh, sorry if I sound a bit weird. I've got a cold, like anyone can believe. Oh, that's far better. Oh, yes. Oh, desert map, I like this one. June's very... Oh, there's artillery, though. Ah, oh. with this artillery, it can be a very bad game for me, especially if you first spot in the Centurion, because all the artillery fire and one like from a Jag from a GW Panther can take up half your health and destroy half your systems. Because Centurion, you know, historically impervious to artillery, is vulnerable to them. Because the dust game doesn't take into account the layered armor of the Centurion. Also, it's Amorak DC, so I've got a few perks, luckily, on this tank, so it's not too bad. Time to roll out. Let's roll out, fellas! This better be a victory, otherwise I'll probably go down to 56% my win rate. I don't know why I bother with statistics, I don't really care on most tanks, but on this one I do. I like it. It's not as good at climbing up hills as the second one that comes after it, the um, Centurion 7-1, which apparently from a scene from videos is an absolute monster when climbing hills. Yeah, you go first, M103. I think it's an American Heavy. Stop spamming! Affirmative! Affirmative! That's the best thing I've ever seen on chat. <laughs> if you pop your head up again, mate, you're gonna go to the cleaners. And not the nice kind that make all your clothes lovely. I mean that, the cleaners who do horrible stuff to you in your sleep. I 
I should really get some like four premium rounds just in case I'm against like a really important heavy who's got hardly any health left or something. So I've been in a case a few times where I just can't pen that someone's got hardly any health left. Help me get a few more kills, even though it will cost money. I don't really care. Experience is more important at this moment in time to me. Kind of run right there. He's just like a big version of me. Better arm, but less maneuverable. Same speed though. Okay, I'm going to have to advance a bit, help my teammates because I can't do anything back here, unfortunately. Or maybe I can hold down right here and still shoot through. No, it would appear not. But if I go here, I can be sheltered from the artillery and still be possibly sheltered from the artillery and still aid my allies in glorious combat. Okay, he didn't even spawn. Fuck capture, what? Yeah, no one's going for the cat point, we need to... Whoa, he took off 500 health, and I mean RT'd. Got some people heading on the cap now, so I think I'll just stay up here and help these guys out. Just can't really get down there. Actually, I might be of use there, because over here, I can't hold down, I can't really do much. Yeah, maybe if they spot and get up on this ridge and I can fire down at the fuckers because there's a few heavies there I've done it before so my only defender medals actually been on this map from a I'm proud to say that my actions actually won that game because otherwise we would have lost. Oh, I could flank these guys so hard If there wasn't an IS3 there I get a shot off of this guy at least make him panic arm oh, and he's moved out of range Fuck okay, it, I'm going to have to move, I've been spotted. I need to get somewhere I can fire, but without being fired on by the IS on the flank. So here seems a bit good. It means I won't be held down to the person on the... Uh... Oh, and we got a KV-2 on our flank over here. I mean spotted, so I'm vulnerable to arty. There we go, finished him off. No, I thought I might have killed his command. I might be able to kill his commander, but oh, artillery sighted. No, oh, I got him still! Fuck yes! The Hummel might have done it, but I killed the artillery. Fuck you, Hummel. I think I hit a building instead of him. Never mind, next shot will go through. There we go. There we go, he's damaged. Good. Got a T32 left and he's over here. Let's go hunting him before he gets our artillery. That T32, if he's clever, he's just hiding somewhere. Ah! Enemy armor is 
Oh, yes, he's been... He's been tracked. There we go. Got two kills on that game. Not bad. I'm not going to capture... People moaning on chat. Oh, 1,300 experience. Not bad. So that's one th only 1,000 damage. But I got a lot of scouts and damage on so That's not too bad. And I received a potential of 1,390 damage, but I think I only actually lost four or 500. Oh, I only critical damage one of them, that's a shame. I could have hurt him. But I do have to say, I do love this tank. It's so good fun. I love it, I enjoy it. Especially with Sixth Sense. Jack of all trades makes it better. Because people like to die in this tank. And repairs. And situation worse. I think I should get camo for it, because it's got no camo rating whatsoever. Okay, let's have a go. Let's play the cheese. Back on this map, match map again. I'm rarely on this one, to be honest. Twice in one day. Not too bad. You got a few IS-3s. I think they're tier 9s. So I think my job's just going to be support then. And we've only got one artillery per side, so that's good. That means I don't have to worry about it too much. And is it only M41? They still killed me before. I think I've been hurt by them, so it's not very nice, but still. I was quite a few low tiers, so I think what my job's going to be first is a bit of sniping. And then on the hill. Time to roll out. I might should get vents on this tank, because bloody hell do I take long to reload. I've seen with vents, it takes just a tiny bit longer to reload that gun with half as much of, um, fire as this gun. Half as much of rate of fire. So, uh, 6.9. It should be 6, because that's, uh, because it's supposed to be 10 shots a minute on this one. And this is with 100% crew. Oh shit, yeah, I'll get it out of your way. I can't, that was an idiot me. Sorry, mate. I did not mean to get in front of you. I was too busy waffling onto myself. And actually, I'm not going to stick here because I've got no camo rating. I'll be easily seen and I'll be sniped. I'll be the one they all aim at. So it's probably not good for me to stick around there. But to head up here. So let's go. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Oh, scout sighted. Let's see if I can get a pot shot on him. He's so badly going to die when he finally gets here. I can't see him. But they can. Ah, oh, speed people speaking in German. Nah. That was a bad shot, and I should feel bad. Let's head up the hill. But he did his job, he lit people up for his arty. And he survived. Which you can't really ask more for. So I suppose I'll get up this hill, hull down on the side, so when the enemy try if any enemy try to advance in the centre bit, I'll get to fire on them. And if they start to rush over here, I can help the allies up here. And because I'm hull down, they only see my turret armour, which is good. Which means I might be able to fit ping at a few shots. And I'm not too bad in heals, I'm fast in the heavy, so I can catch up with them. Ah, oh, the scout. There he is, I can see you, you motherfucker. No! Artillery's gonna fire on me any second now. There we go. Three shots, and finally I hit him. And no arty fired at me, which is even better. Because they they fuck me up big time in this tank. Right, a bit further up and I might be able to support my heavies here. Ah, 
Ah, oh, T-59s, how I hate thee. I want one though, but you have to unlock them because you can't buy them. Fuck. That first one, pen no damage me. The second one, pen and did a shit ton of damage. 400 damage. He's got a nice alpha there. So I can't actually adv I can't advance and help these guys. Because these guys are just going to fuck with me. There is a guy over here. I can't see him, so I can't, I can't aim my friends. Been seen, so I can be artilleried. So let's retreat a bit. Well, they're just in a line. Artillery's going to have a field day with them. I believe that's the term field day for the Yanks, you know? Should be like a field trip or something. I don't know. Oh, Ferdinand's doing good though, right there. Kill the two people till two people try to advance over here. Oh, and we're flanking the guys over here, so it's not going too bad. We're finally getting them. Yeah, worth it, so totally worth it. Make him panic a little bit. Maybe take him out because he's anti-tank, I think. So taking him out is important. As fuck. There we go. He's out. He's out of the game and I didn't get damage. That's even better. I took out an anti-tank. Those things can really hurt our heavies. If I take out that fence... No, I can't take it out. It's just... It's just, it's not even hitbox forward. You can go through it. So if I go down in the ditch, maybe they can't actually hit me. Oh my god, I got pings on the turret. Type 59, he's down! T-59 is down! We can advance a little bit. Ah, oh, so it's the rule at the moment. He can hit me, but I can't hit him. But he just keep picking my turret, so I'm not, I'm not moaning. Heavies, advance! Fucking advance, heavies! We got them flanked. They can't hurt us. We can hurt them. It's exactly what we want. Oh my god. Oh, I'm being artillery. This is not good. My job now is to take out this IS-3. Nothing else matters. I'm going to die from artillery right about now. You're being ra ramming! Oh no, if I could survive one more hit, I could have rammed him and killed him. Could have got three kills, but I failed. My fault. My incompetence got me killed. I apologise to my team for that. I could have changed the match in an important way, but I didn't. But he's dead now, so I badly damaged him, so I helped him being taken out. I helped the VK. I could have helped more. I could have got that kill. I could have not fucked up, but I did. So I do. It's a shame these guys now. I think they can do it. We outnumber them quite a bit, so as long as they... Those last three guys, not including the artillery there when I said three, um, aren't boss, we'll be fine. They're trying to flank us, the medium, the PZ4, Panzer IV, on the... Um, to our south. Right by our, our base, actually. But he's got a heavy to fight. And he's supported by artillery. And possibly a Ferdinand. So, yeah, he's dead. He's out of the game. Yeah, he was killed by the Ferdinand. He was doing a boss job, by the way. Hats off to you, Kappa 12.
He's, are you waiting for the heavies? It's a good idea. Because he's still got two, artil two um, anti-tank, one artillery. The artillery, too, he's got two kills, so it means he might be, out of, might be low on ammunition. But he's decent. He knows what he's doing. And we've got two tank destroyers, so that could cause us pain. If they're good, if they're just... I would them if I was them, just the two tank destroyers. Protect the artillery and take down as much bastards as they could with, it, with them. That's what I would do if I was them. Okay, he's doing a search and destroy for the artillery now. He's not here, so go to the other side of that little lake there. That's where they're bound to be. Near their base somewhere. If I was them, I'd either do a defense position, like I just said, to tank destroy defending the artillery, or every man for himself and just try and hide somewhere and hope the enemy captures and you survive the game. But on this map, it's pretty hard to run due to the big lake in the middle. So you're either going to come from one or two directions where you're both easy to spot. So I don't think they're going to survive this game. Oh, he's been artilleried, but he's found him. He's not protected by tank destroyers either, by the looks of it. And just ram him. Ram him. That's all you have to do. Ram him once. No! You could have rammed him and he would be dead. Oh, he did. Side rammed him. Nice. Good job, friend. Noob? How is he a noob? He did exactly what he's supposed to do. How is he a noob? M41. He's only a tier 6 as well, and he's got two kills on a tier 8 match. He's doing fantastic. This guy, Yin Yang, you're doing good. He's on no way near a noob. I've just got one jig tag left. Jig tig. Jag tiger. Where's the Fernand? He's, oh, I don't even know where he's gone. He's still somewhere. That's the T-32. It's not... No, no, it's not. It's over there somewhere. Anyway, I was just babbling on about nothing there. Being an idiot. Oh, you got five kills, but now near Top Gun. I've never got Top Gun. I won it one day. 1,000 experience. I only got 953 damage, but I did get two kills. One of, And, yeah, I took out one of their important anti-tanks. And I did do only one bit of scouting. But I did hurt three people overall. That IS-3, I did 448 damage to. So not too bad. Could have been better. Could have been worse. But I received so much potential damage there. <laughs> and I actually made money. Only 78, but I made money. And that's what counts. And I was in the top half of my team. So I was um, number 6 altogether. Only the Fernand... The Fernand didn't get more. He got 3,000 damage and 5 kills. The IS got more than him. How the fuck? Did he like scout a load of people or something? He only got like, he only got, I, he only got like six more, like five, seven, seven more experience than me. What the fuck? And he only got, but he got, what? I understand why he, because he survived. But still, that's a bit crazy. Cray cray. Anyway, I'm going to end the video there. I'll, um, I might do some more videos on Centurion because I love the fucking tech, especially when I get the next one I'm going to do for some videos. Anyway, see you next time.